A trio of teen suspects busted for car burglaries in Palo Alto. KPX 5's Marie Medina tells us that these smash and grabs could be connected to a bigger crime spree. Maria? Unfortunately, Palo Alto saw a nearly 70% increase of car break-ins from January to November of last year compared to the year before. And 2020's numbers aren't off to a great start. They're just grabbing what they see inside and they're taking off. And so a lot of times it is difficult to catch those thieves. But in this case, the law caught up to these teen suspects and two minors accused of smashing windows Monday morning and stealing what they could find inside cars. We had somebody call Call 911 because they saw a group of male subjects and they were banging on car windows. Palo Alto police spotted the suspects near Amarillo Avenue and West Bayshore Road, where they allegedly broke into eight cars. Tonight, shattered glass still remains on the street. So right now, detectives are looking into the possibility to see if these same suspects are possibly related to other auto burglaries that have occurred in the city. In Palo Alto, from January to November last year, there were 816 car burglaries. In 2018, there were 485. That is a 68% increase. But that's not counting the car break-ins in the last few days of the year. Police say between Christmas Eve and January 2nd, there were 44 car burglaries. The people who are doing these break-ins are so brazen. Many of the break-ins happened in downtown along University Avenue and the shopping centers like Stanford's Open Mall. I don't feel safe leaving my car, even in highly populated areas where there's a lot of traffic. Um, I lock it all the time, but I still just don't have a sense of safety. Police say the five teens from Monday's case who range from 17 to 19 years old were in and out of cars within seconds. Well, there were burglary tools, two window punches, as well as gloves in the car. Uh, one of the suspects also had a ski mask. And the suspects are expected in court tomorrow. Police say they recovered some stolen items inside the suspect's car. In Palo Alto, Maria Medina, KPIX 5.